Greetings YouTube and today I'm making a video dedicated to Atari Leaf. So I hope he sees this video and this is on my video game room tour. Now this is nothing big, I'm no like Pete Door thing or whatever his name is. He made his video game collection room tour. And I'm making a video and I'm making my video game room. So I should start off. It's nothing big. Is here that just just a phone? Okay, right here we got my Atari 2600 games. Put all my active game games together. Okay. And starting with Expedition Titanic. Starts my computer games. This game doesn't work. Pretty pissed about that. Yeah, this um, Call of Duty 4 doesn't work. Right here we have pretty much my only B-Smile game. This is Toy Story 2. It's all of a burnt right there. I don't know how that happened. Maybe my friend got to it. But that's like my only B-Smile game and they're not enlabeled. Keep it right in the corner over there so nobody can see it. Duplicate Atari games. And that's basically... That whole shelf over there. Right here is my fan artwork on Angry Video Game Nerd. I put the little F there. And right there we have Atari 2600 joystick versus the Nintendo Entertainment System controller. Well, it's just like Atari versus Nintendo. That's what it was like. Made it enough gold today. If you wonder why it's all black here, it's because I wrote, He's gonna take you back to the past. But, uh, like, I couldn't fit it over here, so, I just couldn't get it over there. Wait, what? I just couldn't fit them. He's going to take you back in the path. But, yeah, got that shelf right there. And over here, we got the, okay, the console collection. Okay, right here, we have the V-Smile, like the worst system on Earth. An Atari 2600. Two joysticks. The PlayStation. The PlayStation 1. With the, um, BioGrip joystick. The Zone 40 Wii knockoff. I even show you that it's the knockoff of the Wii. First off, let me start off with the controllers. Look at this. They look exactly like Wii. And look at the system. It looks exactly like the Wii. Oops. <laughs> Look at that. That, look, that looks exactly like a Wii. Except for like this and it's a little bit odd shaped there and it says Zone 40 Wireless Gaming right there. But yeah, that's all my systems. I don't have a lot. I'm hoping to get a Nintendo. NES for my birthday. I want to get the FC3 Plus because I want to get the Super Nintendo and Sega Genesis. So, yeah. Down here we got my plug and plays, which are awesome. I got the Wheel of Fortune plug and play, which I really don't know what that does. I really never played it like when I first got it. I did. When I got that, I really didn't appreciate video games that much. Like, this is like my first plug and play ever. So, yeah. I really don't care about that one. This one is my... Well, it's actually my dad's, but it looks like really cool. So, I just keep it in here. It is a Atari 2600 plug and play. And right here we have my Pac-Man. With 10 games inside, I think it's around 10 games. Yeah, around 10 games. Built inside this, so that's pretty cool. My Miss Pac-Man plug and play with a... Five games. Yeah, five games. Real exciting, but... This is really good. Because I get Miss Pac-Man. And another better Pac-Man video game controller. 
like this, but this one looks like an arcade stick. I'm making a um, video game arcade machine, which I hope I can probably do a video on how to make one. Put that up. So, yeah. I don't know. What, well, what I meant to say was, I'm going to make a video on how to make a arcade machine. I hope. I don't know if I will, but I probably hope I will. Down here, I got my PlayStation 1 games. And I know what you're thinking, that's your PlayStation 1 collection. Well, I got some games in this thing. My friend game to me. Some of the games didn't work. But I smashed all the ones that didn't work. Two games are missing right there. That's probably where I destroyed Driver and Driver and Disc 2. Driver 2 and Driver Disc 2. Driver 2, Driver Disc 2, and Driver 2 Disc 1. Those games were just terrible. And then I got some more games here. Games, games, games. Oh, big surprise. More games. Oh, look, a game. Hey, what do you know? A pencil. Yeah, I gotta get a new case for this because this is getting broken. PS1 right there. And I got more games too. Okay, I got Pac Man World, which they sent me in one of these things. Why? I don't know. And... Nuke Duke Quinn, Time to Kill. That was an okay game. I mean, like, it's okay to shoot, but... It was a pretty fun game, but I can never really aim. I could, but it just gets hard, like, you know. Okay, this is Activision Classics on the PlayStation, which is, like, really cool. I hope I review this one day. But my only complaint is, like, that... You only... Like, there are paddle games in here. Like, kaboom. There's a paddle game. But you do get the two River Raid games. So that's pretty good. And I have now pretty much, like, a lot of active games. Which I got in my, that shelf over there. Because I, now I got them in here. But now I have a few more duplicates now. Now I have a few more duplicates. Sadly. I'll fix that later. Right here I have another terrible game. It is a plug and play guitar. Guitar Hero. Button. Whammy bar. Budgets. Very crappy. Don't care for it at all. Right here I have just like my crap in. I like some interesting stuff. Like I got my Atari paddle controllers in there. My guitar AC adapter and some AC boxing for old TVs. So I don't need that anymore. Well, yeah, that's my video game room. Bye, subscribe. Subscribe to me and 113DSC. Bye. Peace.